All right, Shalom. First and foremost, we'd like to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rechak Kodash, the ones that are ill, the apostles of great meals, so that do a will, and salutations, and bless to you, Akim, that's pushing his word with true sincerity and charity. All right, now, hey, we come with a lesson, and just in the spirit of all this rioting and all this BS going on, man, all this protesting and stuff, man, so-called protesting, man, because, hey, uh, I, elders and apostles, man, and they elders and apostles on down, have been protesting the righteousness, hey, for hey, for over six, uh, about, you know, 60 years, man, so to speak. You know, so, we, hey, for a long time, we've been protesting. But what? You people have not hearkened. You know, but, hey, hey, if you want to go, in all honesty, man, hey, since, since the word began, you know, prophets and the Lord sent us, sent his prophets out early, man. The Lord mm -hmm. been telling people what right to do and what not to do. And in this captivity... Uh, um, right now, hey, what have we been doing out here um, on the highways and byways? The uh, rightly dividing the truth through the spirit, man. Mm -hmm. But hey, this is John seventy seven, and this is the Messiah who people eagerly call Jesus Christ, man. But his name is Yahweh Shai. It says with John seventy seven, the word cannot hate you, but me it hateth, because I testify of it that the works thereof are evil. So right, the Lord testified of the word that the works was evil, man. That uh, um, all this uh, BS going on, all this wickedness in this world, man. Because when you go into a uh, protest, man, it goes back to uh, testifying. It goes back to testimony, pro, you know, a uh, forward testimony, mm -hmm. a forward testifying, man. You know, hey, and hey, what is the testimony of our Lord and Savior, man? You know, um, Revelations 19 mm -hmm. and 10, it says, And I fell at his feet to worship him. And he said unto me, See thou do it not. I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren that have the testimony of Yahweh Shai. So, hey, so that shows that the prophet will have the testimony of Yahweh Shai, just as the angel, man, the testimony of Yahweh Shai. It says, Worship Yahweh, for the testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. So, hey, th the real protest is to protest in righteousness, man, to declare the works of the Lord, to declare what the Lord is going to do, what the Lord has done, why the Lord has done it, and what is the will of the Lord, man. Hey, and these people writing in and all this nonsense, that's not going to save you. Taking it in your hands is not going to save you. <laughs> it's just not possible, man. Right. Because, hey, at the end of the day, two-thirds of our people, man, they, they will never come to the light, you know? They're going to always be inside the darkness, man. All right? They're, 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 they're going to protest against wickedness to do fucking wickedness, man. <laughs> you know? But since I said that, let me grab this John 3 and uh, verse 19. So this is John 3 and 19. It says... No, let me just John chapter 3 and 18, man, because hey, this this is the this is the whole thing, man. He that believeth on him is not condemned. But he that believeth on but but he that believeth not is condemned already. <laughs> so hey man, these people are already condemned, man. Whether or not you you out here protesting for uh uh um George George Floyd, all right, his uh um uh to what, what whatever the man, these people are protesting, man, for for no for no reason, man. They don't know why. They don't even know why. They don't even know why they out there, man. They they claim to be out there for George Floyd, but you out here looting, you out here uh, uh committing murder, all right, doing all this shit, man. When the Lord told you to come back to Him, man, all right, and repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand, not going and fucking protesting, man. You know, but uh, it says, but he that believe it not is uh, is condemned already. Because he hath not believed in the name of the only begotten son of Yahweh. Hey, man, these people are already condemned, man. All right? Because, hey, they, they don't serve Yahweh Shema Shai. They don't think upon, they don't look towards the ways of the Lord, man. It tells you that in uh, uh, Psalms, the 10th chapter, in the 4th verse, man, that uh, um, 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 and the thought of the wicked is not Yahweh, roughly paraphrasing. These people don't think, uh, think upon Yahweh Shema Shai, man. You know? It says, verse 19, and this is a condemnation that light is coming to the world. All right, the real uh, uh, protesters, man. All right, the light has uh, come into the world through Yahweh Shah, man. And we have been pro. Hey, the prophets been been out here, man. Hey, the Lord said that He rise up His prophets early, man. Yep. You know, right, yeah. this is Jeremiah chapter forty four and verse four. How be it, uh, I send unto you all my servants, the prophets, rising early and sending them, saying, Oh, do not this abominable thing that I hate: committing adultery, eating fucking pork, uh, uh, killing your neighbor. Uh, having the evil add towards your brother, man. All of those things are wicked, man. And that's an abomination. I tell you how about Shemel Shah, man. Sure. All right. So 
Hey, that's that's what we've been telling y'all, man. We've been telling you to to get right, protesting against you so-called uh, uh, Negroes, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man, against uh, wickedness. You know, so this is uh, this is John chapter three and verse uh, John three and verse nineteen. It says, "And this is the light that, and this is the light." Uh, I'm saying, Slakin. And this is the condemnation that light is coming to the world, and men love darkness rather than light because their deeds were evil. Hey, man, these people love uh, uh, this darkness, man. All right, because their deeds are evil. They they love they love uh, uh, the ways of Esau, Edom. They love this this world, man. Hey, when I say darkness, man, all right, I speak uh, uh, um, a Babylon and great. All right, all the wickedness that goes on in, in, in this uh, in this place and this entire world, man, because the earth is given to the hand of the wicked. Right. So this is Job chapter 10 and verse uh, 21 it says, before I go hence, I shall not return even to the land of darkness and the, sh and the shadow of death, a land of darkness as darkness itself and of a shadow of death without uh without any order and where the dark and where the light is as darkness and that's exactly what our people love man Babal, confusion man yeah. not, not nothing that's set that set up uh an, an, an organization man hey and, and then riots who lean the rights you don't even have an answer man because no one no one is reading those, reading those rights man it's complete and utter fucking chaos out here man you know man. hey hey this is the tip of the iceberg man yeah this this ain't nothing these people are literally protesting. So the person, and it talks about Jeremiah 13, chapter 23rd verse, a hey, custom to do evil. Mm -hmm. they, yep. You are literally, they, it says they have a perpetual hatred. So what you are doing is trying to seek, <laughs> you are trying to seek a, a love from yep. someone who cannot love you. It's just not, it's not possible. Come. Esau, Edom, the heathen, Nations as well hey. cannot love Israel Israelites. That's right. It's just not possible, and we can't even love each other. If you're not in truth, I, you go hate each other. Just like they they protest, they start protesting. Then what? They start going against the Northern Kingdom. Yeah. The Southern Kingdom start going against the Northern Kingdom. Yeah, but hey man, like you said, man, if they were in this truth, man, if they were of your how about Shah, man, they would love each other, man. Yeah. But hey, they they don't they don't love they don't love uh, uh, the Lord, man. They don't love themselves, man. Only thing that they love is folly and wickedness. Uh, precept Lamentations 4, huh. uh, 17. Uh, this Lamentations 4 and 17 says, As for us, our eyes as yet failed for our vain help. In our watching, we have watched for a nation that cannot save us. Mm -hmm. Th these people are watching for a nation that can't save them. And, they, and these people are watching trying to get saved from their uh, salvation from Esau Edom, who needs salvation from himself because he's going to destroy everything if he continues to be in rulership, man. It's just completely, complete and utter folly and nonsense, man. These people, hey, they been, they was protesting, uh, uh, um, how many other uh, years ago? I don't even know. Years upon years, man. What the fucking fuck Mal Malcolm doing? X, Martin Luther King, all them people, <laughs> and what they do? Get smoked. Yep. Uh, uh, with sellouts to begin with. So you people are idiots, man. You are all in a trick bag while Esau is in a trick bag. Because the Lord has him in a hey, trick bag. Hey, the deceiver and the deceiver are his. Is. Hey. You know? Yeah. Hey, all, all of these people, man. Hey, at the end of the day, all these people are bending to the wheel of your Shemal Shah, man. Yeah. You man. know? But, hey, at the end of the day, man, if you're wicked, you're wicked, man. You know? Hey, this is exactly what's going to happen to to all the wicked of our people, man. So this is Amos chapter 9. In verse 10, all the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. Right. So, hey, man, if you don't want to come back to Yahweh Bashim al Shai, man, you, if you don't really want to repent, man, all right, like Yahweh Shai said, all right, because, hey, Yahweh Shai was a, 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 a prophet as well, man. All right, he was the ultimate prophet, you know? Mm -hmm. Hey, he, hey he, uh, he, he was saying, hey, repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand, man. John the Baptist, man, all right? Hey, hey, uh, uh, I told you in um, 1 Peter 3. Hey, that uh, the Lord would wish that all men would come to repentance, man. Want all men to come to repentance. That's right. You know, and all men, that's speaking of all Israelite men, man. All right? The Lord wants all Israelite men to come to repentance. You so-called Negroes, Hispanics, and Native Americans, man. You know? But it says, we say the evil shall not overtake nor prevent us. Because, hey, man, two-thirds of our people don't believe that going out here and looting, all right, going out here uh, being a complete fucking nigga, all right, is not going to come back and bite you in the ass, man. But it is, man. All right, cause hey, if you if you partaking in, in wickedness, man, all right, it's a reward for that, man. You know. Yeah, man. Hey, these people are literally running around, man, and thinking they these people literally think they can save themselves, man. The scriptures say 
Uh, Deuteronomy 28, chapter 6, a verse that no man shall buy you. Yep. Buy is redeemed. You're not going to get saved, brought back by a man. The Lord is going to come back as a power, man. He's, he's not going to meet us as a man. Right. He's not going to come back in that flesh, man. Yeah. But these people, they, they, they look at Esau, Edom as a, as a fucking savior, as a God. You know, they they honestly believe that this man can solve can solve all those problems, man. When they see when when they see a a, a man dressed up in, in military camo, all right, they, they they look at that man as a hero. They look at that man as a god, like this man can actually save me, man, but he can't. You know? So this is Romans 6 and 23. For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of Yahweh is eternal life through Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, our Lord. Hey man, if you if you serve Yahweh Shemal Shah, man. All right, you're gonna get eternal life. All right, you're you're gonna uh um, be you're gonna be okay, man. All right, but if you're not serving the Lord, man, hey, that death has to come for you, man. You know. So this is First John chapter two and verse fifteen. Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. All right. So, hey, man, if you choose in this world over your Habba Shemal Shah, man, that love is not in you, man. All right. And hey, if you don't love the Lord, man, the Lord don't love you. All right. And if the Lord don't love you, He's gonna destroy you. So verse 16, for all, for all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes and the pride of life is not of the Father, but it's of the world. And the, and the world passeth away and the lust thereof, but he that doeth the will of Yahweh abideth forever. So amen. If you do the will of Yahweh, by Shemal, Shaman, all right, and don't sin, all right? Hey, we, we, hey we're going to sin regardless, man. We're all going to sin because we're in this flesh. But amen, you have to try your very best not to do wickedness, man. All right? Now... If you if you just blatantly being being wicked, man, like these people out out, out here, man, hey, you're you're hey, you're, you're gonna uh, get a judgment for that, man. All right, and that's death, man. You know. All right, hey, man. The scriptures say, "Wait ye upon me." Mm -hmm. So I raise up to the prey. Hey, the Lord said it's His determination, man. In that same scripture, the Lord's determination is a God of the nations, man. It's, it's to uh, uh, put the heathens in slavery, man. Hey, and, and no matter what you do, no matter what you try. It will never work, man. That's why you have to uh, sit back and wait on the Lord. All this stuff is going on, and these people, uh, uh, first reaction is to do something themselves. It's to do this, do that. Man, it, I seen a post, bro. It's talking about some, basically, we go win this time. How? I mean, we, the elect, Lord, wouldn't that be us, man? But the elect is going to win this time, but not by their own hands. Right. Through the power of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, man. That's how they're going to win, man. These people think they can take on Esau Edom, who has a, a vast military, man. While these niggas got Glocks and fucking knives and shit. Right. Man. Hey, it's good to say, uh, uh, let, let not a man glory in his might, man. Yeah. You got to glory in the might of Yahabah Shemel Shah. Because, yeah, hey, man, at the end of the day, you, you picking up guns and, and picking up things, uh, weapons for yourself, man. It, it, hey, that's not going to help you, man. All right. Hey, it tells you in the book of Jeremiah that um, I got you right here. Con. Jeremiah seventeen and five. That's right. That's right. That's exactly what I was trying to get. <laughs> Spirit. It's Jeremiah seventeen and five. It says, "Thus saith Yahweh: Cursed be the man that trusteth in man and make of flesh his arm, mm -hmm. and whose heart departed from the Most High Yahweh." That's right. So, hey, man, if you if you're if you're uh, uh, trusting it inside of your weapons, man, you trusting inside of your own might, man. All right, that's gonna get you destroyed, man. All right, because hey, if you if you're not leaning out to the ways of your Shemuel Shai, man, the the uh, um um the end thereof is death, man. All right, because hey, if you you're you're choosing uh, um you're choosing flesh, you're not choosing your Habba Shemuel Shai, man. You know, hey, the Lord the Lord said to uh uh um only be courageous, man. All right, only have courage, man. Sure. Only be strong. Hey, this is Joshua one and seven. It says only be that only be thou strong and very courageous that thou mayest observe to do uh, uh that thou mayest observe to do according to all the law which Moses my servant commanded thee turn not from it to the right hand uh, or to the left that thou mayest prosper where uh, whithersoever thou goest and amen two thirds of our people will never prosper because they don't trust in Yahweh Shemal Shai they don't look upon the commandments of the Lord man they don't they don't look at, at another man's woman and say. Well, you know what? That that is adultery, you know. So I, I'm 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 not gonna I'm not gonna uh, go and mess with that woman, you know. So, uh, hold on. Right, right, right. Hey, man, it says uh, uh, only be thou strong and, and very courageous, man. So hey, you 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 can't you can't be weak out here, you know. But 
Hey, with that, we like to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Chakodash, the ones out there, elder apostles of great mules, and that do it well, and salutations, and bless you, I can just push his word with true sincerity and charity. Shalom, and a Baba Ball.